Hello my dear students, I welcome you all for SVK tutorials. This video is only for uh, mechanical stream. So as they are requesting to do uh, the passing capsule for uh, mechanical stream, I am doing this video. See if you move on to module 1, in module 1 uh, it is uh, of uh, complex numbers. Module 1 is of uh, complex analysis. So I have solved all these uh, problems in my previous videos. You can refer my previous videos. I can uh, give the link uh, in my description. You can refer those uh, problems. Definitely you can easily score 20 out of 20 marks in this module. At least uh, try to study CR equation or uh, derive CR equation in Cartesian form and in polar form. Definitely one question will be there from that part. So you can easily solve that problem as it is a derivation. You can score minimum of 6 marks from that model. So or else uh, you can also go with uh, finding the analytical solution, finding the analytical solution uh, for who's for real number or uh, who's for real part or imaginary part. They can ask or else you can go with standard form of derivations, these kinds of uh, derivations. Minimum from this module, if you study the only these content, one is derive uh, CR equation in Cartesian form, polar form and standard uh, uh, derivations of this kind and problems on analytical function using uh, for real part or uh, imaginary part if you solve this definitely you can score minimum 14 marks from this module or else you can score minimum 7 marks from this module if you study this much moving on to module 2 again in module 2 also i have discussed these all these kinds of problems in my previous uh, video you can refer my previous video as I have solved almost all the problems I have solved uh, tra uh, transformation of uh, w equal to e power z sin z cos z like that so Cauchy integral for theorem I have discussed uh, BLT problem I have discussed in this module also if I see just if I go through the syllabus I can tell you that you can score 20 out of 20 but as you are asking for passing capsule so I can say that you can study BLT problems definitely one problem will be there on BLT problem bilinear transformation and standard uh, theorem will be there Cauchy integral uh, formula uh, Cauchy integral theorem or you can have discussion on uh, transformation I will uh, fix with only these two transformation of uh, W equal to F of Z and BLT you can score minimum of 14 marks minimum of 14 marks in this module also so no doubt for passing yeah, you don't have you no need to worry about passing you can easily pass the examination so when you come to module 3 module 3 is of uh, probability right now i am also doing some uh, videos on uh, probability and also you can refer my previous videos i have already solved uh, by, uh, problems on uh, uh, random variable uh, mean variance binomial distribution uh, probability density function poison uh, distribution all these things i have done already you can go through and refer my previous videos my dear students so for passing capsule if you ask uh, they have been asked find the mean and standard deviation of binomial distribution or they can ask a poison or they can ask normal distribution like this so you can go with this one and also you can solve you can study only this kind of problem definitely one problem will be there of uh, using a random variable so if you move on to choice uh, choice problem also see here they have asked for uh, mean and variance so using uh, probability density function this is what i told you pdf or cdf so using pdf or cdf so they will ask mean and variance or normal problem mean and variance definitely one problem will be there you can fix for minimum of six marks apart from that you have a standard problems on uh, poisons uh, poisons uh, and uh, here um, uh, normal distribution normal distribution problem is there and also uh, uh, one more uh, exponential distribution is there so out of these binomial poison uh, exponential normal so apart from studying how to find mean and variance using uh, pdf or uh, cdf so if you study any one of the distribution out of four distribution binomial poison exponential normal if you study one you can score minimum 14 marks if you are not able to study those you can score minimum 6 marks. You can score minimum 6 marks. So no doubt in that. So moving on to module 4. Module 4 is very much easy. When I compare to uh, earlier modules. It is of linear programming. If you solve the problems on linear pro programming. You go with uh, only one form. 
uh, you can go with the you can consider canonical form so definitely one problem will be there on canonical form or a false method you can choose better go with the uh, phase method this will be a very important phase method or canonical form you choose any one of the method definitely one problem will be there you can score minimum 10 marks from this module but no doubt in that if you study both the methods you can uh, score uh, 20 out of 20 going on to last module uh, there will be a transformation problem transportation problem uh, assignment problem on this uh, module so you can study either one of the problem if you are feeling uh, difficulty in solving these problems you can at least study either trans go with the transportation problem or assignment problem so it is a just tabulation problem uh, tabulating uh, the values and uh, getting the answer is very simple so i prefer you people to go with both i recommend you to go with both the uh, problem but if it is not possible try to convince with uh, only one method and try to get 10 marks from these two modules you can score me minimum 10 10 marks each so if i calculate all the modules from module one if you take minimum marks i am taking minimum marks six marks here yeah, from module two minimum marks i can take that is again i will go with seven marks from module uh, four also i will go with uh, seven marks in from module four i will go with the uh, 10 marks in module five i will go with 10 marks totally how much you can score now you can score uh, 20 year uh, carry to uh, 2 so you can score 40 marks my dear students without uh, any doubts you can score maximum marks that you want that is called uh, 35 marks you needed uh, just 35 but i am showing 40 apart from 40 if i calculate whatever i have considered 10 plus 10 20 20 marks here then in this uh, module also i have considered 14 marks i think so 34 34 plus uh, uh, 48, 48, 48 plus 60, uh, uh, 62 marks. You can score 62 marks, but you needed only 35. Definitely, you can score 35 marks, no doubt. You need to know how to choose the problem, how to go with the problem. So, which is best for you? Choose that from that module and study. You can score minimum 35 marks and you can usually. Yeah, and you can usually pass this examination. No, nothing to worry. I wish you all the very best to your upcoming examination. Thank you all for watching this video.